What's up people of the internet? Today I'm going to make a turmeric shot or well it's a drink today. Sometimes I just put it in a little shot but today I'm making more of it just because it tastes good. But I use it to um, help take care of like aches and pains. It's great for knocking out inflammation because turmeric is really uh, really good at that. So um, not a lot of production value in the video. I'm just doing it quick and uh, easy like so here we go. Here are our ingredients. I got my blender, I put some ice in there. I'm not really getting specific with measurements. You can adjust all the measurements to fit your taste. It's just important that you have most of these ingredients. The only ingredient you really don't need is the lemon. This is a whole lemon. Well, probably half of a whole lemon. Peel, seeds, juice, everything that I put in a blender and, and um, frozen ice cube. This is fresh turmeric root. You can get it in most grocery stores. I don't peel it or anything. This is frozen because I buy it in bulk and, uh, and freeze it. It's a little bit of salt here. Maybe, I don't know, I'd say half a teaspoon. Here's some whole peppercorns. You can just grind some pepper in there if you want. Um, and then this here is a little bit of coconut oil. And then finally, this is some tomato-based vegetable juice. Um, this is a preferred brand. It's, it's essentially VH juice, only it's organic. Um, and those are your ingredients. Um, before we put it together, I just wanted to go over. The salt is just for a little bit of flavoring. Pe uh, the main thing here that takes care of your inflammation is the turmeric. Turmeric contains an ingredient, active ingredient called curcumin, if I'm pronouncing that right. Um, and it's just an amazing anti-inflammatory. It's also, I believe, an antioxidant. Curcumin can be activated or turbocharged, so to speak, by an active ingredient in black pepper called pepperin. So when you put the two together, it makes the effect much stronger. And curcumin is a fat-soluble thing, so that is why we put a little bit of coconut oil in there. Also, um, you can use olive oil. I like olive oil better, but I'm out of that today. So those are the three main things you absolutely need. You need your turmeric, fresh turmeric. Um, I've never tried it with turmeric powder. Fresh is always better, though. You need your black pepper and then your, your fat of some kind so that your curcumin can, can be um, diluted or, you know, broken down into the fat. Um, and then the lemon here is just for a little bit of extra flavor. So I just dump all the stuff in a blender. You don't need a lot of fat. I guess it's maybe a teaspoon. I'm making two glasses that probably going to be a little bigger than that. We'll put our pepper in there. I like a lot of pepper. Our salt. Our lemon. Lemon's optional for flavor. And then a bunch of our juice. It's almost like the whole jar, but that's okay. It's good for you. All right. Gonna blend that up. It's gonna get noisy. I'm recording this on the YouTube app, so you can fast forward through this part if you want, but there's no real way for me to pause it, and I don't feel like cutting it together. All right, Cody, nobody wants to hear from you, girl. You're too noisy. Look at her, she's over there raising hell because she thinks I'm making coffee. All right. It's gonna get noisy, so turn your volume down. You've been warned. She's over here making all kinds of noise. You're way more interesting than a blender. What's going on? Look at the tongue going. You've already had your coffee fix today. Nobody was giving you any more coffee. You're beautiful. You're beautiful. Look, she's giving me the foot. Oh. 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 All right, I think the blender's done. The blender's done. All right. 
that's what you get there. I don't know if there's any point in continuing on with these, um, especially because mom just took my glasses. So um, anyway, all right, I guess that's it.